But when we start experiencing cramps, people look to potassium and they look to magnesium. And occasionally those are the things, but generally the problem is sodium. Sodium is the, the thing that ends up staving off the muscle cramps. And so I, I would just strongly recommend like either curtailing a little bit of that water. Like if you're drinking it because you're thirsty, that's kind of one thing. But if you're drinking it because you have a sense, I need to drink a lot of water because that's healthy, I, I, I would mm -hmm. question that a little bit and maybe try to reduce that by like a third to a half and, and see if that addresses the problem. If you want to continue to drink that water, then I would do something like Element or your own homebrew of mm -hmm. electrolytes and really focus on and the track, sodium. And track. And so just like yep. you enjoy tracking the protein to track something that you're trying to maximize, you can track sodium that way yep. too. And make sure, I mean, start. you can start smaller, but work up to 3,000 milligrams a day and see how you feel.